just randomly running up to people and saying, this is me, now this is me, now this is me, now this is me, now this is me, now. Do you When I was young, I never needed anyone. And making love was just for fun. Those days are gone. Oh, shit. Okay. All by myself. Don't want to be all by myself anymore. Oh, shit. Best, I can't. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. That intro, ooh, girl, that intro. Listen, best friend, I should join Circus Olay, bitch. I could, I could bend in places I did not know I could bend, bitch. My husband's gonna be real happy, girl. Ooh. Best friend, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. This is the first time you're watching my channel, honey. My name is Sebastian, and I welcome you all with open arms. Yes, best friend, I am luxuriating sitting on the floor best friend but i am so excited to be here bitch i have to tell you best friend that listen we got to talk about jennifer lopez but before we do best friend i need to talk about you i need to talk about you best friend stop doubting yourself okay you're going in the right direction all right don't lose fucking faith okay and you got this I don't want to hear it, all right? Listen, those people who wish you ill will, best friend, that's because they live in misery. You wish well, you get well. That's all that matters, best friend. Anyways, girl, let's talk about Jennifer Lopez. Um, so, listen, let me, let, me get, let me get comfortable here, okay? Okay, here we go. Um, there's a video going on around and it's going viral with Jennifer Lopez and uh, her daughter, okay? It's at the Grove, which is one of my favorite places ever. It's this outdoor mall in Los Angeles. We go every, every weekend, we go to the movies there. It's fabulous. She's there and I have to say, best friend, that it, it pissed me off in so many ways, this video. Check this video out and then we can talk. So these are some of the comments. Basically, girl, you called them. You went to the Grove. What do you think happens? Um, yo no entiendo por qué tantas fotos. Eh, bueno, that's like in Spanish saying that, you know, they don't understand. And then she looks back at them for one more shot. Uh, why doesn't she go to a different part of L.A.? She called them to be there. Then she pretends to be mad. Really? She needs to move to Idaho. Normal. Está con su hija. Deberían respetar eso. Uh, it says they should respect that she's with her daughter who goes to the Grove on Saturday. Um, I love that she is shocked every single time this happens to her in public in the daytime. The way she waited for them to start taking pictures before she acted bothered. Never called. Cared about, about her privacy. 
um, retail therapy more press. Y como saben que los paparazzi, a.k.a. iba a estar ahí, they said, how come the paparazzi knew she was going to be there? I've never once seen paparazzi at the Grove and plenty of celebs deaf called them, which I've been to the Grove every weekend and yes. I always said this about being a celebrity. Like, I, I can't imagine... Like, I love the idea of entertaining people. You guys know this. I love the idea of putting myself out there. I love I love all of that. And, you know, I, I, I love it so much. And it's my greatest gift, one of my greatest gifts. But I can't imagine, like, go, you know, like, for example, if you go to the Cheesecake Factory, right, and you accidentally have some kind of milk product, right, you're going to get fucking bloated, well, at least in my case. And you're going to come out of that fucking Cheesecake Factory with, like, a nine-month, you know, pregnancy belly you're gonna feel so uncomfortable all you want to go home is all you want to do is go home and eat the leftovers and have that cheesecake at, at the privacy of your own home so all you want to do is get from the cheesecake factory to your car and put that uh um uh, seat down because you know you passenger princess and you just want to get home in your air conditioner and just eat your leftovers in peace with the big shirt that you sleep in you know what i mean but then imagine you're coming out of the damn cheesecake factory and you have a bunch of paparazzi and a bunch of people just taking pictures of you wanting you to stop this and that. And you're over here. Your stomach is stomaching. Your head is head aching, Your anxiety is anxiety. What are you going to do, bitch? What are you going to do? Do you know what I mean? So I will say this. You, you know, Jennifer Lopez is not my cup of tea, okay? She stopped being my cup of tea a while back. I always say this, disclaimer, I used to love Made in Manhattan, used to love Monster-in-Law, used to love her first couple albums, but then it's just, she's not my thing, right? So I haven't really checked on her for years. And now that she's in the, in the media and in the public eye because of her decisions, I, of course, you know, we started talking about her because she's trending. But I will say this, best friend, you could see in her eyes how desperate she was for them to stop filming her. Now, all the comments, all of the comments are, she called the paparazzi herself. She has a paparazzi on speed dial. You know, she, her phone rings. Okay, this is like, people are saying this is her phone, right? And it's like her ringtone. La, 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 Hello? Uh-huh. Yeah, no, I'm going to be at the Grove at 3. All right, see you there. People really think that that is what's happening. Now, listen, I will tell... I, I'm going to say this, okay, best friend? I'm going to give you two different, um, two different realities, okay? The first one is that she calls him like everybody else is thinking, right? Okay, what does she get by calling the paparazzi on herself, right? Which I know celebrities do this all the time, best friend. What do you get from it? Like... If she is doing that, what is it benefiting? It's just making you look bad. It's making you look like a victim, right? Because obviously when you're in the public eye and paparazzi are dis disrupting your day, obviously you're like, girl, you know, leave me alone, right? They look like the victims. But because nobody believes that they're just popping out of nowhere and, and finding her at the Grove, I've never seen paparazzi at the Grove. I go to the Grove every single weekend. I never seen paparazzi at the Grove. I've seen celebrities and I've seen them in disguise and nobody's bothering them. Jennifer Lopez goes out like Jennifer Lopez. That is the issue, okay? That is the issue. So that's the one reality that everybody is saying that allegedly she's the one who calls the paparazzi. The other reality is I believe that when children are involved there has to be some kind of law that forbids these grown men to take pictures of these children. I think that it is horrible, but I also think that Jennifer Lopez is not doing a great job by protecting her children from these people, okay? Because just getting mad at them and yelling at them every single time they go out, that's not doing shit. That's just making her look bad, okay? So... I, I'm sorry, I, 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 girl, listen, I live in Los Angeles. I've seen plenty of celebrities. I've seen how celebrities handle certain situations. Jennifer Lopez could easily get a disguised car, a disguised car, a car in disguise, whatever, bitch, you know, a, a, a car that no fucking paparazzi know, hide in it, put on a hat, put up her hair, you know what I mean? And maybe even wear a face mask and nobody will know it's you. 
but she goes out like Jennifer Lopez. She goes out with the hair, she goes out with the, with the outfits, right? She screams Jennifer Lopez. The bitch could be going around the mall just randomly running up to people and saying, this is me, now this is me, now this is me, now this is me, now this is me. Do you know what I mean? She might as well just be doing a free fucking concert. You know, imagine all these people eating and she's like, if you had my love, that was a song. That was my song, bitch. So I'm just, I, so the whole internet is saying that she calls a paparazzi on herself. I'm trying to give her the benefit of the doubt. But if you didn't call the paparazzi on yourself, you're not doing such a good job hiding from the paparazzi. Do you know what I mean? So that's the part that annoys me. I'm just like, girl, help me help you. Like, if there was something positive to say, then I will say it. But I just feel like she doesn't like to help herself. So it only angers the public because I will tell you something, best friend, listen, between you and me, right? Like, when I do a Jennifer Lopez video, when I do any type of video, right? I talk about every single celebrity that's trending. When I do a celebrity, you know, video, I talk about it, I press stop, I don't think about them, right? I don't care. But there are people who are actually really upset and get very angry and start petitions and, 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 and want, you know, her to never, never sing again and never anything again. I just want Jennifer Lopez to sit down with Jennifer Lopez and think about things. Do you know? Listen, if you want to step away from the music scene, right? You will never stop being Jennifer Lopez. So you got to figure out a way to then find the new normal. Dress down, wear a hoodie, put on some glasses, put on a face mask. Tell your daughter, hey, you know what? You wanna have a normal day? Let's wear a face mask, okay? Let's wear a face mask and some glasses. Nobody will know it's us and we can, we can go to the movies, we can go to the Cheesecake Factory, we could do it all. That is their new normal. Whether they like it or not, they are Jennifer Lopez and children. That's it, best friend. So it's just sort of like, no wonder the whole internet thinks that she called the paparazzi herself because she's all glammed up. She looks like Jennifer Lopez and then she's screaming and she looks furious, which I understand because if she didn't call them and they're stalking her, then it is fucking furiating because she's trying to spend some quality time with her children but you're not doing a great job hiding from the, from the world that you created and that you wanted to live in, period. I'm sorry if that sounds mean, I'm sorry if it doesn't sound sensitive, but girl, go to fucking Target, go to Walmart, go to Ross, go to Ross, go to Ross. Get yourself a hoodie, bitch. Listen, you all with a hoodie, right? Let's say this is a big, big, like gray hoodie, right? Go out with a hoodie. Put on a face mask. Girl, you don't know you don't know it's you, right? Pretend this is like a you know, one of those like pretend this is a gym outfit, you know, that has like a what is it called? Like a you know, like a a hoodie, right? That hoodie. Put that hoodie on, you know, no hoop earrings, some glasses, a face mask. You walk around, nobody's gonna fucking know you're you, bitch. But I just feel like she doesn't help herself. So I'm sorry, but I can't help you, girl. Listen, call me. And I will give you some tips. How come we don't see Britney Spears nowhere? We don't see Adele nowhere. We don't see Beyonce nowhere. Bitch, we don't see Taylor Swift. We don't see Selena Gomez. We don't even see hey, the Kardashians as much as we see Jennifer Lopez. And that's saying something, best friend, okay? So sorry, bitch. I don't know what to tell you. Anyways, best friend, I hope and pray that you're having a fabulous day. And if you're not, the little redheaded girl did say that the sun will come out tomorrow and it always will. And I just wanna leave this to tell, I wanna uh, end the video by saying this. If she did not call the paparazzi herself, I 1000% agree with her anger because imagine trying to spend quality time with your child and these grown men are just taking pictures of you and your child. It must be really difficult. I hate when people take pictures like at parties and you know, like those spontaneous pictures that you're not ready to pose in. Do you know, you know the ones I'm talking about? Like when you're with your friends and like you're in the end of the table and you don't know that they're taking pictures and you're like, you know, oh, I hate that bitch. You gotta tell me because then I'm like, 
you know? Anyways, girl, what do we think? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you have a fabulous week ahead. And I hope this does not sound like I am hating on her, sending her ill will, none of that. It's just, I'm trying to give you both realities, right? And the whole internet thinks that she called the paparazzi on herself. So I'm just trying to give her the benefit of the doubt, but I'm also trying to send her some tips. Anyways, girl, I love you all. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.